YouTube Christmas Eve update. I think that the XRP pump has been confirmed. But before I give you this news and new piece of evidence that we uncovered, I got to give you the disclaimer. I am expecting a pullback. This is a warning. Okay, between now and the end of the year, I am expecting a pullback for the overall cryptocurrency market, especially for Sologenic and XRP after this airdrop. You can expect a pullback. But the overall market, Bitcoin cannot break above 52. And I think that we're about to see a pullback between now and the end of the year. So be, be ready for that. But I believe that this new piece of evidence that Prosperity Fund over on TikTok uncovered is leading me to believe that the pump for January has been confirmed. Let's get into it. So unfortunately, he had music playing in the background of his TikTok. So I'm not going to play that here. Can't get the copyright strike. But make sure you go check out his TikTok. I stitched one of his videos or this video this morning if you want to check that out. Big shout out to Prosperity Fund for bringing us this information, but let's get into the news article. Incredible energy. I didn't think that anyone could be more bullish or hype on XRP until I ran across Prosperity Fund. Quick shout out to you, brother. Thank you for staying over the target in regards to XRP. But let's get into this piece of evidence that we just came across. So we have 1.18 billion XRP being moved from Ripple to its strategic ODL partners and exchanges. This is speculation, obviously, but it would lead me to believe that they are funding the exchanges and getting them ready to handle uh, a massive pump. And this is lining up with the complete timeline that we're expecting to take place next month in January. The lawsuit potentially ending, settlement happening, the discovery phase ends January 19th. The SEC and Ripple have to discover a settlement, so we're all going to be speculating. But even if we don't get the settlement, just the hype alone off this coin and what's happening in the space, the liquidity ready to flow out of uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum into all the altcoins, altcoins like XRP that have not gone on to hit their all-time high yet. You know, And so, like I say, whether the settlement happens or not, I do believe the XRP is going to see massive moves next month. And the technical analysis does match that. If we take a look here at Crypto Bull showing us the weekly chart for the XRP Bitcoin, uh, we have XRP breaking out on the weekly chart. And he says the last time this happened, the price went from 50 cents to nearly $2. So the technical analysis is matching up with this as well. And, and this is all lining up for a beautiful, beautiful pump in January. Getting Dark Defender's most recent thoughts, he says, Hi all, some might think we changed targets. We didn't ripple one millimeter. These targets have never been financial advice, but technical insights into where XRP is heading to. Believe it or not, blue pill or the red one. Always make your own choice and create your own reality. And know yourself. Let's take a look. So he's telling us here that the third wave is going to take us to three potential levels. First target being $2.64. Next target being $7.24 and the final one being $19.88. So somewhere in between there. Okay. And the fourth wave is going to pull us back. And then we got a final fifth wave that's going to take us to finish off this uh, Elliott wave pattern that we're showing here on the charts. Dark Defender, like he said, the targets have remained the same. He's been talking about that $2.64 level that we, we need to break through for a while now. So... When you line up the technical analysis, when you see Ripple loading up the exchanges on XRP, I combine those two things together and it tells me that something is in the cards here. A massive pump is coming. And, you know, just the hype alone from this case potentially settling is enough to take us on a move like this. We don't even need a settlement. I think that that's like the big miscon uh, misconstrued fact here is that we need to settle up for us to go back to all time high. We went to all-time high, which was $3.80, give or take, without Coinbase, without any of these major exchanges. It was hard to get XRP back in 2017, 2018. Now we do have uh, more exchanges, you know, not as many as that we would like to have. Obviously, Coinbase and the major ones that have delisted it doesn't help us. But this isn't about retail pumping it. This is about institutional investors moving their money from Bitcoin and Ethereum into XRP. 
And all it's going to take is a few hundred billion for XRP to reach out to these targets. Seven to thirteen dollars has been my target for a while now, and that's where I'm expecting us to go to, um, with or without settlement. So, not financial advice. And the big disclaimer, big disclaimer, is that I am expecting a pullback between now and the end of the year. So we're not getting too excited, not getting too hype yet. Okay, be ready for the pullback. If you need to pick up the dip, your time could be coming right here in the next week. Be prepared to buy the dip. But I do believe that we're sending this thing into next month. The technical analysis lines up. The movement of the XRP from Ripple to the exchanges lines up. This is not financial advice, but I hope you guys have packed your bags. Thank you. Have a very Merry Christmas, and we will see you in the next one. Take care. God bless. Thank you.